Today, we open the video with sad news. P. Ray leaves us. After six years of honorable service, our legendary P. Ray leaves us, but he bequeaths his son. Ladies and gentlemen, Sidero, the new iron remover by Labo Cosmetica, with unique characteristics in the world of iron removers. The first. It has a called fluid reverse gel formula. You can dispense a liquid which becomes gel in contact with the surface and adheres like a gel. A kind of Spider-Man. And just like the Spider-Man, you don't need to get tendonitis when you dispense it. Because many gel products in the market are either too dense and very difficult to be dispensed, therefore creating a problem of tendonitis. Or in summer, when it gets hot, they become a little too liquid and drips and do not adhere as they should. In brief, they don't have the effect which they were created for. Better grip on vertical supports. Another characteristic of Sidero is its concentration. It's more concentrated than P-Ray and more powerful than P-Ray by 30%. Besides having great decontaminating power, it has a very high cleaning power. It's so powerful and safe that it allows you to clean the inside of the wheel rims without double wipes. Later on, we'll see some extreme tests about what Sidero is capable of decontaminating and cleaning. Another characteristic is the slow drying. A very slow drying. We'll see outdoors how under the July sun, how long it will take for the product to dry off, and this allows you to have an enormous safety of use. The famous I Forgive You technology by Labo Cosmetica will be put under pressure right under this July sun. And then, last but not least, the capability of removing limestone particles. We've lowered the pH by a half point to give the possibility of melting the limestone that normally forms on the wheel rims. As you know, wheel rims are the most exposed part to limestone of our car, and these deposits don't allow many applied coatings to work to their best or cause them to suffer. Sidero has been designed as a three-in-one product, decontaminates, cleanses, and purifies from limestone. The other important thing, which never gets old, is its scent. A very very pleasant wild berries fragrance so that we forget that smell of sulfur which is present in almost every iron remover. P-Ray had already been a reference point on the market for its pleasant fragrance used to cover the smell of sulfur. Sidero has raised the bar. We'll perform a test outdoors. In order to perform a serious test on its safety of use, we've decided to do it under the July sun. I'll melt as an ice cream under the sun. It'll be hotter than hell out there, and I'm worried. The battlefield will be a hood. That to say that it's contaminated is an understatement. We'll have contaminations thick as cheese crusts. <laughs> the surface is so rough that we could even light a matchstick on that hood. The P-Ray product had been the reference point of the market for the iron removers. In terms of decontaminating power and safety of use, but we'll see it with the newborn. We'll see if Sidero can amaze us. Follow me outdoors. In an outdoor square, under the July sun. Let's see how this ends. Here we are. Our friend P. Ray, which has given us much satisfaction. Today we'll compare it with Sidero. Why P. Ray versus Sidero? Because to me, P-Ray is still one of the best decontaminants on the market. P-Ray was competitive in terms of cleansing power. But in terms of speed of action and decontaminating power, very few could beat it. I haven't seen one in my career yet. So what better opponent for the new Sidero? What better handover than doing a direct test, P-Ray versus Sidero? A derby. And let's find out together the reasons why the Labo Cosmetica Labs have decided to create Sidero. Let's go! This is a hood taken from a really bad scrap. As you can see, I guess there was a tin bucket leaned here. When I first saw the hood, I thought it was a decontamination of a car that had stopped at a train station for a long time. Instead, I'm finding out that it was placed under a rusty metal roof that contaminated it. And it definitely did. Before doing this test, we need to do a vaccination against tetanus here. <laughs> Fine. We'll call it the tetanus test. Apart from a roof that leaked out and a bucket leant on the top of it, here we have mold problems or moss was forming. Excellent test to see also the cleansing power of Sidero. 
on this side, so let's choose this one. You see, there is the round mark of an iron bucket that was leant on it, along with various contaminations. This part has the toughest contaminations. I think here is the legendary P-Ray. We can immediately see that its reaction is instant, an always beloved characteristic by the P-Ray fans. Ah, I almost forgot the scent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another thing of Sidero. P-Ray already had a good scent. But Sidero is unmatched. Look at its reaction. Frankly, I'm sorry to abandon P-Ray. If we have changed, though, there was a reason to. In fact, there were four reasons. We'll find them out during this and the next video. In this video, we're going to see the performance of Sidero. And in the next one, we're going to see its safety of use in action. It took us almost one year to create the fluid reverse gel-based technology. We had a mania for this formula. Look at how easy it is to be sprayed by using a normal trigger. I don't need a nozzle with an atomizer, and my wrist doesn't hurt when I dispense it. Oh, I forgot. Let's spray here, too, where there is this mixed filth of mold and traffic film. The scent is, has a wild berries fragrance, the pleasant scent with strawberry notes. Huh. I have to spray here, guys, on the hood side. Amazing. It's so sticky. You see, it doesn't drip. While on the ground, you see the P-Ray has fallen down and created a puddle. Another consideration besides the scent that I smell and that allows you to use Sidero indoors. Sidero has the same surfactants of our Purifica product. This makes it possible to have increased capacity of removal of limestone residues that deposit especially on wheel rims. Wheel rims are those parts where there is more limestone formation, and so we also have beading and sheeting problems on wheel rims which have been protected with nanotechnology or sealants. So, by using Sidero, we remove these limestone deposits that tend to stratify wash after wash. Look here. How do you know if Sidero has found limestone on the surface? When you see that instead of the golden color that you see here, it becomes dark green. If you notice some spots that become dark green, it means that Sidero has found some limestone and it's melting it. There was some limestone there. What a weird feeling I have here. Apart from a fantastic lubrication, everything slips here. Here I really feel the contamination grains that have detached. I feel the clean part. I feel from the rough one. It's rough here. I feel it rough. Here, there are some parts completely clean. I mean smooth. I even feel some sand. It's like Sidero has detached the contamination. It leaves it suspended and then melts it. Like, yes, some sand that is melting. Let's freshen up. Let's freshen up P-Ray. To make it work a little longer. You see that it continues to... You see? This was a trick to keep it wet longer and keep P-Ray working. Look here instead. Look at that. Fruit jam. It looks like blackberry jam. Wow. Wow. Look. Look. You see that there are still the small spots on it. Look here. You see the small spots here? There is still the continuation here. Look. There's nothing here anymore. Can you see it in the video? It's so powerful that I'm thinking of using it in the nautical line sector. 
where there's this type of rust contamination every day and where acid products are very used which then ruin the gel coat. However, you see this cleansing capacity when cleaning the wheel rims. Let's wait for it to get dry. It's smooth here and completely melted. Here, in these stains here, I feel like a step. Here the paint is missing. Here it's working directly on the iron part of the metal sheet. I'm sure that my friend Reggie Cox, who is watching the video right now, is laughing while seeing my magical finger in action, as he loves to call it, when he sees me making the demos without using the gloves. He teases me. He's right. We have to use gloves. I'm not wearing gloves. You're right. You're right, Reggie. But what can I do if I love skin contact and to feel the touch with my products without using gloves? <laughs> Let's freshen up some more. Let's let P-Ray work some more. That's it. Here, P-Ray has finished working. Let's take them off. Come on. Look, it hasn't dried yet. Sidero can lie on even 40 minutes and it doesn't get dry it never gets dry let's rinse off no way to continue i'm sorry for p-ray wait i have an idea let's do like this let's wipe up with a glove let's wipe it up a little bit let's use a wet cloth here p-ray has done something It's like having a shampoo here. Here, I feel an incredible lubrication, as if it were a shampoo. You can pass a clay bar directly on it if you want. And yes, let's see here. The edge was very dirty. Look at how clean it is. It seems like working on a blueberry yogurt. It's so smooth down here. My goodness, look at that. My goodness. Let's get it dry under the sun and see the final result. Well, you've seen both the decontaminating and cleansing capacity. Let's try to move into the shade, if you can see better. We have seen its cleansing capacity. I haven't done the usual test on the wheel rim, guys. Look there, that wheel rim over there. Because it's too simple. I've done it here, the cleansing capacity, and you see what it's been capable of removing. Is this a five to six year filth? Look at the result. Look at that. I still feel it rough here. I feel it rough. Look at the result. It's all taken off here. It's almost all taken off here. Let's look at the reaction it has. Now let's see what's going on to happen if we spray the product on it again. Now let's perform the ultimate test. To do the ultimate test, we switch the dispensing of the products. That is from this side where there was Sidero, we dispense P-Ray, and from this side where there was P-Ray, we dispense Sidero. According to the speed of action, you'll understand which product decontaminated better. I already feel it, but I want to do an extreme test. I'll try Sidero diluted at 50% from this side, and I'll show you how concentrated it is. Look! Look at the speed of reaction that Sidero still has. Diluted one to one. And here, let's try. P-Ray Pure. Do you remember when I told you before that it wasn't smooth here, but there were some clumps? Here they are, where the paint is missing. 
Here it's working directly on iron. Yes, on iron. Look, although it's diluted, Sidero always adheres to the surface. Here the paint has literally come off. We work on iron here. That's why, that's why we see red, because it works on iron. It's not the decontamination above. It misses. We've arrived at the support iron, so it necessarily decontaminates. Many people very much like Piray because when the customer of a new car came in, he was asked to decontaminate it. The customer said, the car is new, it can't be contaminated. Then all you had to do was to spray a little bit of Piray and immediately the contamination was seen and you could sell the decontamination service. We have exaggerated here even cutting one by one. We have an immediate view of its decontaminating action. Guys, honestly, you won't find anything better at this price because Sidero diluted one-to-one -one is equal to P-Ray Pure. Therefore, if you dilute two parts of water and one of Sidero, you already have a multifunctional decontaminant at the height of big brands. Yes, look here. I feel the same feeling as before that it's taking the particles off. Yes. I have to leave it on here. I think that out of respect for P-Ray, the test has come to an end here. Come on. You see it was on metal. This is the metal. Therefore, just like an iron remover, it colored by touching the metal. That's why there was that red stain. It wasn't a superficial decontamination. It was really the metal. And rightly, Sidero did its job. Here it pickled. Look how shiny it is. Look how shiny it is. You see here. You see that it shines? Let's finish the test. I don't want to. It's right that we stop here with the test. I think it's enough. I don't want to interfere. I don't want to interfere. It's not fair to the legendary P-Ray. Let's go. So guys, did you like the test? You didn't expect a hood like this, huh? These are the characteristics of Sidero. But there are many more that we'll see in the next video. That on the safety of use. Sidero is so powerful. But is it safe too? Let's see the next battle.